Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brandy and this is Beautiful Eye Bargains. And this is part two, jewelry jar number two. And we're going to see what's in here. I'm not too sure if there's going to be much good in there, but let's dig in. New to my channel, thank you for being here. Oops. And enjoying the chaos of my crazy videos. Ooh, this is really pretty. Ooh, right to the pretty pile. I'm gonna try and angle y'all so you can see me get on the sideways so I can see what we're doing. Ooh, look at that. That one's kind of pretty. Oh, I think we might have found one of the earrings from the other jar from the other day. Pretty sure this is a fidget thing. We opened the, uh, the other jar that was full of one earring wonders. Oh my lord, what is this? This is attached to a chain, but that's a good piece for reselling, hopefully. Here we have another cool vintage chain. I don't know if it's meant to be this kind of antique buy, but look at that little flower. Okay, I'll see you. This is an earring. And I'm pretty sure the other one is in the other jar. This is Leah Sophia. In pretty good condition. It's nice for fall. It's a good time for fall time. Oh, wow. That's kind of pretty, isn't it? No signature on a leather chain, but really pretty. Here's another... Tinkerbell? Oh, this is one of those. Oh. Goes in between your nose. We'll have to get that cleaned up. Is my life so white? <laughs> supposed to go? I don't know. I'm going to look that up. Here we have a really cool fairy. I really, really like this one. This one's neat. Very cool. Okay, we got some cool pieces in here so far. So far, so far. This one looks like it could be broken. Some green beaded beadlock. Now, what is going on here? Seems like everyone's a mess. I love the tangle more than the, the bits and pieces. I'd rather sit here and pull the tangle apart than go through the bits and pieces. Legit. Alright, this is just some fun fashion wood jewelry, some pretty beads. Looks like this might be the same. I wonder if there's earrings to go with this one. Cool. 
Ooh, nice, beautiful, heavy hematite. This is a copper toned bracelet. And then this is a vintage um, shell. Oh my god, I love this one. This one might stay in my collection. Oh, I love the colors. Love that one. Okay, that one's going in my favorites. And then this one needs to be repaired by the looks of it. Probably going to a beadlot. That speaks for itself. Some beads. Yeah, what is this weird thing? <laughs> That's a different. I've never seen anything like that before. Again, I would just be playing with this stuff all day long. I couldn't wear this. I'd be fidgeting with it all day. Legit. Then we got some more earrings, some old fashioned earrings. These are pretty heavy duty, like they're nice. I'm gonna make a lot probably with those. Here is a ACO watch, which is fashion. Nice heavy duty one. This is also fashion. This is kind of neat. I like the coral. Maybe I'll do a jewelry lot. Coral, coral jewelry lot. What y'all think? What would you do? Ooh, this one's nice. New condition. Look at the face on that. This one's really nice. Cool. Good one. This one's just a vintage faux pearl necklace. In good condition. Oh, wow. Oh, I thought that was metal. No, it's not metal. It's glass. Got kind of like a bubble effect in the back. Like you see how the silver is worn off on the back. Wow, that's so cool. Cool. I like that one. And then we got some of these big heavy duty poopy earrings. We got those two. These two. We got it hair <laughs> those are from the 90s take it away oh I think this is one of those rings for your belly button or oh there goes the ball Me back the ball. <laughs> Don't lose the ball. I will never get this thing back in there now. Oh, maybe I will. <laughs> that over there. This is a magnet from Whistler. No Whistler. That one's really pretty. $7.99 going on my fridge. It says Italy. Must be from a rosary. Oh, wow. That's a bald eagle. Or a bird with some inlay. Oh, wow, these are <sighs> kind of 
kind of stuck together. Pretty little emeralds. But I'm not sure if they are actually emerald or not. No nope, plastic. There's two of them. So that's neat that there's two of them, but they're definitely vintage. Definitely vintage. Oh, this is pretty. It's just a fashion ring. Still really pretty. Dainty. Dainty little bugger. Here we have another rosary cross. I actually have a pretty nice collection of crosses that I've found over the while. This one's really nice. And then we have this flower charm. Okay, so this one's got a signature on the inside. It says... A L E R five eight. I gotta look into that and see what that's all about. It's really pretty on. And then there's this little guy. Oh, this is all signed as well. I think it's a stainless steel. Size seven, but what's the rest of it? Yeah, I think it says stainless steel. I wonder if this all goes together. It kind of looks like. It kind of looks like it does go together, but I'm not sure. We're going to do some research. We're going to find out. <laughs> it kind of looks like it does go together, but I'm not sure. We're going to do some research. So yeah, you guys, this was a pretty good jar again. We've got a couple little cool finds in here. We've got a lucky charm. Got some one earring wonders. I'm a little bummed over the one earring wonders. Then we got this toe ring. I'm really intrigued with these guys now. I really want to get some more info on these. More info. I can't see what this guy says either. I mean, the ring is tarnished on the back, so, like, it can't be that good. It's definitely showing some tarnish, but still wearable. Oh, I missed this little guy. This looks like it could be sterling silver. Pretty bracelet. Again, now we got a couple of good pieces. Most of it will be um, rejarred, put into jars to list on Poshmark. Looks like we got a lot of one earring wonders to go through. I mean, if these rings have any value, they'll pay for the jar, hopefully. But there were some good pieces. I'm happy. Are you happy? Because I'm happy. We're happy. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for joining me and watching me on Jar This Beautiful Jewelry. 
again we did get a couple good pieces for resale and then yeah I got a good feeling about this guy anyways I hope you all are doing well and I hope to see you again soon on the next one bye